He graduated from Corbin High School and studied at Cumberland College in Williamsburg, Kentucky and at Austin Beach State University. Mr. Monday's career started when he was just a mere junior in high school. He started working at the Corbin's Times Tribune and stayed there for eight years. He worked in the classified department, the circulation department, the dark room, and did some photography as well. In 1960, he started to leave Chron as a chronicle here in town. At one point in time, he was the only full-time reporter to, report, to cover all of Montgomery County. He started writing his only line column in 1965, and he continues to write it today. Mr. Monday has been wonderfully blessed by his family and friends. He married Laura Steele in 1956, and they had one daughter, Kathy, born in 1968. On April 5, 2007, it was our privilege to have Laura Monday as a resident of our, our facility. She went to be with the Lord on January 26, 2010. Mr. Monday has two grandchildren and three great-grandchildren with one on the way. He was both a choir director and a member of the quartet group, the Heralders, for over 50 years. Mr. Monday loved gospel music, and in fact, he comes to our facility every Sunday morning to play music for our residents. He also did this for multiple other facilities starting in the early 1980s. He served as Santa Claus for the Kiwanis Club, whose focus is on young children for over 26 years. And I bet he made a jolly old St. Nick. <laughs> <laughs> he also financially supported multiple veteran groups at Fort Campbell throughout the years. And when Mr. Monday was not playing Santa Claus or music for our residents, he enjoys music, photography, painting, and taking cruises with his wonderful family. It is my privilege to introduce tonight, to induct tonight, Mr. Jim Monday into Signature Healthcare Parcel 2012 Hall of Fame.